Scott Payne was prolific, building a succession of faster and bigger boats and aircraft. These were being sold all over the world. His high-speed boats were first bought by the RAF Marine Branch as rescue launches. For hundreds of years, seagoing ships and boats had rounded displacement holes like this model. They were stable and streamlined and allowed the boat to push through the water. But as speed increases, it creates a larger and larger bow wave that will eventually limit a boat's top speed, known as hull speed. Scott Payne knew a way round this ancient law. Rather than a curved hull, he used a flat bottom with sharp edges called hard chines. Like his racing boats, given enough power, this design lifts the hull up onto the surface of the water, overcoming the drag that a bow wave creates. It's called planing and allows boats to far exceed their hull speed. But his perseverance with the Royal Navy finally paid off. In 1935, with the RAF ordering more high-speed launches, the Admiralty ordered its first motor torpedo boats. This is the commissioning ceremony of the first of them, MTB-01. 